Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Origins. Uh, if you look at the top right, uh, you're going to notice something a little bit strange right off the bat. And I want to talk about this for a quick second while we're uh, doing this next bit. But I am level 45. The level requirement for this mission is level 35. So I am drastically... Uh, above the level requirement for this so much so that I might make the last mission a bit easier Though I will tell you the fight is still a bit hard so it's not like I'm gonna be breezing through it uh, by any stretch of the imagination so you don't have to worry about that but uh, I did that because there was a boosting option and I was asking a couple people like do you think this is okay um, I asked a couple of you guys what you thought and most people pretty much said the boosting's fine you know if you're not grinding on screen it's not like we're losing out on anything anyway uh, and it would speed up the process for me it'll make the ending a little bit uh, Less stressful for me to have to like figure out what level I should be and stuff, you know. So I just did the boosting thing, which automatically levels you up to level 45. And then I told myself I'm just not going to use any of those ability points. So I didn't touch any of that. Uh, it did upgrade some of my equipment and stuff, but I figure that's, you know, kind of the trade off. But as far as like ability points, I'm not going to touch that anymore. So I'm not going to give myself this insane advantage. So I have the ability points as someone who would be level 35. Actually, technically, I have the ability points of someone that would be level 32. So I'm actually a little bit under uh, what you would expect. But my character as a whole is a level 45 character. So, you know, it all just kind of depends how you're looking at it. So that just in case you're curious. So I'm high leveled, but my character is not like an overpowered level 45 character. In fact, you could sort of say my bike is an underpowered level 45 character. Uh, with that being said, from the last episode, we are hunting down Flavia still. Uh, we are in Cyrene, which is an absolutely gorgeous sea. It's one of my favorite areas to explore. Kind of sad that you don't get a look at it at all until, like, the very last couple missions. Uh, we only have, I think, three missions left. The one after this is pretty long, and it's uh, another stressful one. But then after that, you know, we're pretty much at the tail end of this game. So, Yes. So we're going to go hunt down and kill Flavius now. Uh, this boss fight is a tough one. Trust me. It, I like how it says assassinate, but like when you think of assassination, you think of just straight like sneaking up and killing them from behind. None of these missions have been assassination missions lately. They've all been like, you know, straight up just moiter. Moiter. Like, like, but it's like a brutal fight to the death, you know? Which is sad. I miss like actually like assassinating targets. That's, I think I mentioned that earlier on in this Let's Play is like the first half of this game I think is phenomenal. I think the story stays good throughout. It's the gameplay that kind of takes a turn down. A lot of these boss fights are fun. It just makes me sad because, like, there's no assassinating anymore, you know? It's all just, like, huge boss fights at this point. So, in case you're curious, we are heading toward uh, an extremely horrifying place known as the Citadel. Uh, this place uh, just reeks of lots of guards and enemies and stuff. But we're going to be fine. Oh, it's the Acropolis, actually. Never mind. I called it the Citadel, and that's not at all what it is. I guess we'll parkour in. Uh, thankfully, with our character the way he is... Like I said, we don't have to stress too much. Though, believe me when I say that I am still going to be stressed. Okay, so he is all the way up there. Hopefully, we can get there without getting seen. There's guards literally everywhere out here. Oh, hi, guys. Okay, anyway, I'm just going to run. Let's kill this guy. God, there's so many people out here. Jesus. Yeah, so see, like, I'm not just, like, bashing people dead. You know, it's not like it's going to be one-hit kills or anything. They actually still do a good amount of damage to me. Uh, so I hope these fights at least prove, you know. I, I just wanted to clarify, because I don't want people to see the level 45 thing and think, damn, dude, this guy's just, like, cheating now. Uh, the game is not going to be, like, a cakewalk for me by any stretch. So, don't show worry about that, man. Ha! Yeah, no idea I was there. Stupid loser. But this attack, this attack is still very powerful. And that time I remembered to actually chain it. Okay, let's see. Let's see how we enter this place. Ow. Why are you, like, running from me all awkwardly? God dang it. Come on, good. God! I'm getting my literal ass kicked here. What? Okay. See, he told you. Wasn't going to make this mission any easier. <laughs> So, like I said, you don't have to worry about that. My equipment is slightly stronger, but, you know, I'm still, it's still me playing the game. That's why I think I say you don't have to worry about it, because you still have an asshole running the game. So, god dang it, it's going to put me so far away, too. That's going to be the worst part of this, but it, that's fine. God, everything's breaking down on me. 
Ugh. Ugh. I'm trying to fix my microphone real quick. Because everything keeps... Because it's falling down. See, it puts me so far away. It's so annoying. So far away for far too long. Something about this is not Man. Right. I, I was talking about Nickelback at work, actually, a couple weeks ago with uh, my buddy Christian. I've talked about him a couple times on here before. And, uh, you know. And he has a girlfriend named Rihanna, and we were kind of discussing, you know, uh, why do people hate Nickelback so much? And we were saying pretty much just because they're a generic band. Because I always think Nickelback makes good music, you know? And it makes a, it makes a good discussion because it's like they're actually a pretty solid band. Uh, they're just fun to hate, but I actually do like a lot of Nickelback songs. Uh, you know? Oh, God. I thought I was going to miss that jump. Did I love you? Can I climb up this? I can. Let's do this the assassin way. Like I said, at this point, I have no desire to level up. Is someone up here? I was like, who's seeing me from here? I think I have to enter from the back somehow, I guess. The Acropolis. Is that Senu? I can never tell. Anyway, this might be where the entrance is. Ouch. Damn it. I don't know how to enter the... I don't see like a door anywhere on this thing. Because I need a flip. Oh, I see now. I climbed through a window. You just need a window of opportunity. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay, well. That makes more sense. Yeah, there I am. And there Flavius is. With this stupid scepter of like legendary power or whatever. Oh yeah, you're so good, Flavius. And now you will answer for my son's death, Roman. Damn. Egyptian. Now you will bow before your god. Okay. I guess you are my gods. Son, my friends. He's actually uh this boss fight from what I remember is not actually all that tough. He's just very weird at certain points. Why didn't you kill me? Ow. You what? Oh, stop it. He's just very annoying as you can probably tell. He takes a lot of damage to like finish off. There we go. Like, see, so you can see, like, oh, Lord. These are nothing but tricks. God dang it. Flavius, to show yourself, sir. Like, it shows that it's doing damage to him. I don't think it actually is. In another that, luckily, that attack with that chain actually does a decent amount of damage. We pretty much got him. God, he's just so quick. Ugh! Your time on this sand has ended. Your mind will Stop moving so much! Eventually. Where'd he go? Just like all the others. It just sucks because he's like constantly on the run, and it makes it so hard to like get actual combos on him. Ow. There we go. Don't waste it though. Oh, that's gonna get okay. I'm lucky. I luckily I can just run You're through that. That's but a nice. Okay, more of these guys. I think this is just like the order of ancients. Come on, bring it on, baby. It is pretty intense looking the way this fight is structured. I will admit. Ow. Okay, show yourself, Lavius, please. There we go. Gotta keep missing. Yes, for real. Stop being a coward and face me. I 
I feel like there's a certain one that I have to like hit for this to work. At this point, he's almost dead, though. God, they're too quick. There we go. Camel herders and shovelers. That is all Egypt is. Where is he? Okay, this might be enough to take him down. That and then, oh, ye oh yes. Oh, I gotta poison him. I missed my chance though. Oh, I did poison him. <laughs> well, we poisoned, we killed and poisoned Flavius's corpse. And now he is but ash before us. So we killed the lion. Ironically, Septimius is the one that's still alive. What's going on? Okay, I was gonna say, how long is that gonna go on for? I'm just gonna lay on it. My child! Yeah, that's the one thing I do not regret in my life. Wow, of all the things, you don't regret this. killing a child? Your son's death make the order bow to me! Caesar, even. I had Rome! It gave me an empire of a thousand sons, each one greater than the last. Ah! Come on! Finish me! You coward! How am I a coward? Of time! <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I can't do it. I can't. I can't do it. Why? It's all right, Papa. What? I will. I will lose you forever. Not forever. That's okay. For the be best, though. For you in the field of Damn. Well, look, we got the last line now, Kemu. His first kill. My boy is growing up. Even in the afterlife. Damn. So the lion is dead. This relic should never be found again. I am well, so that's big. That's huge, actually. So we finished that quest line off. Uh, now we just have one last thing we gotta do. These people have no idea what just happened in here either. So it's the last Medjai. We gotta go find Ale uh, Aya, and then uh, there's still some unfinished business we gotta take care of that you guys are gonna be able to witness here. And uh, this next little bit. So killing Flavius. Flavius. He's not really like the final boss, but he sort of is like a cap off to sort of end the game in a way. Um, and you're going to get to see sort of how the game really ends. And it's actually really cool. Uh, I'm really excited to show this off to you guys. Because I think this is where the game picks back up. I do hate this next mission with a burning passion though. But what happens during the mission, watching it is a lot more fun. I will say that. For sure. For sure. You know, for sure. It might not even be this mission yet, though, now that I think about it. Anyway, uh, enough talking. Let's just play. I, I'm always, like, so caught up trying to be like, ooh, and this is what's going to happen next, and you're going to love it. And I'm like, just, just shut the hell up, Mike. Let everyone just enjoy the game the way I did. I just, I miss experiencing games for the first time. Like, Danganronpa is, like, my biggest regret of a game I can never play a second time. Because that game was so fun, and, like, trying to solve the mystery of it was incredible. That's why, like, my new favorite pastime is, like, watching other people do it now. You know? Because it's, it's a fun game to experience. That's why I want Travis to get back into it so badly. But I know not. I know not when he will get back into Danganronpa 2. The problem is his Wi-Fi is trash. And it is a game that's way more fun to stream than just, like, Let's Play. It has been too long. Flavius yes, well, has it, really? I have gone to shit to get our son out of the Duat. Kemu is at peace. Nice. May he walk in the field of reeds. I head to Rome, too. Rome? You still entertain fully with these ambitions? I have made oh. mistakes. You have made mistakes. Aya? Brutus. Your energy. Ah. If you know history, do you remember who Brutus is? You are the famous Magi. Thanos never ceases to speak of your exploits. I have assembled a group. This is Brutus and Cassius, our Roman brothers. 
We're going to cut these bastards down from across the seas. Septimius and Caesar. The Damn. order is no longer an Egyptian problem only. Does Cleopatra still rule? There is no ruler in Egypt. Plunged into the will of various tyrants. Our queen Damn. has abandoned us for Rome. What a surprise. Memphis is overrun by the Tell me Cleopatra is maybe not the nicest person ever? Hmm. Never seen that one coming. Bayek's face is so like just what the heck. Well, let's do this. I cannot end it like this. So she just like ran away 600 meters and I gotta like go chase her down again. I like game design. Okay, where is she though? Oh, she's over by the coast. Oh, she's so far away. Oh, whatever. I, uh, I'm over it. That cursed mud sphere should stay hidden forever. I'm just like, how did she get that far away from me? So, much pain. so fat. Why didn't I just walk with her? Like, I, did I just stand there dumbfounded for that long? And I was like, oh wait, I gotta say bye to her before she leaves. Yeah, I'm sure as many of you can guess, uh, this is gonna be yet another ship mission. You know, I think that's why she's like saying, you know, we sail for Rome. Whoa. And it's like, fuck, I gotta sail for Rome again? Damn. And this is the hardest one. I thought the last sailing mission was the last one. Uh, definitely mistaken. I totally forgot about this one. I kind of knew there was a sailing mission here. I just thought this one was a lot more peaceful. Uh, and then I read about what goes down on this mission. And then I realized it's not peaceful at all. It's quite the opposite. It's actually going to drive me absolutely insane and probably get me killed. But <laughs> that's okay, right? I can still be somewhat good at games. I just, I almost wonder if my level is going to actually impact Aya's missions. Because I don't think they do. I think the C missions are almost like totally independent of a... Uh, Whatever Bayek's level is, which would make sense because Bayek and Aya are totally different characters. But I want to say Aya, like, it says level 45 when you play as her. So I have no idea. I bet that's partially why I did it is because this next mission is really horrible and difficult. And I wanted to make it easier for myself to, so I didn't have to stress about it. So we'll see. We'll see how it ends up. What the heck is going on here? Whatever. We go on foot from here. I don't know why I went this weird direction. Oh, there's my love out there. About to take off for distant lands. Kind of depressing, isn't it? There she is. All alone on the beach. Well, this will be depressing, I'm sure. This is very like Kingdom Hearts esque. The like sunset on the eye. It's Destiny Isles. Our bond not so. Aww. We could never have been. Everything has told us our love is impossible. Damn, is she breaking up with me? You're right. Something bigger has called us. But our love lives in the duat. Only now we are letting go. Let the gods decide. Huh. The gods are dead. Damn. You're not going to get in the field of reeds talking like that, girl. Let me tell you. Is that a bottle of wine? our personal lives for the greater good. All this darkness was for a reason. I was wrong to be so reckless in public without killing. We must work in the shadows. Yeah. Egypt has fallen. Greece also. And Rome will fall too. <laughs> All will fall to the creed, yet no one will know. I like the sound of that. We assassinate. We assassinate only those who deserve it. The few sick souls who try to control us. But they will never know who we are. Cold, calculated, poets of the kin. I am fine with this. I am not a father anymore. Dang. I am not a husband. Dang. I am not a Medjay. Dang! I am a hidden one. Dang! That's what I'm talking about, Bayek. Yes. And thus, Assassin's Creed begins. Bayek of the world. A new creed. Ours is finished. Aw, that's kind of sad. Was 
with the famous theme playing in the background. God. Oh, snap! Look at that! There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Aww. Well, don't be sad yet, guys. This adventure, quite literally, is just beginning. There's 3,000 more. So yeah, that feels like the end of the game. <laughs> Definitely not. Don't worry about that. And also, we're also not done with this girl too, apparently. Well, yeah, there she is. Sorry, I kind of zoned out. Looking at my phone, you know, you know how I do. You know how, you know what it is. Alexander was founded by Alexander in 331 BC, is that what it said? All right, there I am, I'm awake again. Who the hell is that? Those don't need to be your last words. Oh, snap! Does the name William Miles ring a bell? Huh. Assassin? Then you know who I am. Damn. We, the assassins, have been watching you. It's. Unusual for an Abstergo employee to take an interest in a country's revolution. You're not wrong there. Well, that's what happens when you trust Abstergo, girl. We know about your work with the Animus. Astounding what you and Deanna were up to. D. They played you, didn't they? Sophia Ricken made you so many promises. Enough! <laughs> we're not talking about her. Sure. Plenty of other subjects to cover on our ride to Alexandria. Don't assume I'm going anywhere with you. Well, let's look at your options. You can come hmm. with me, or you can stay here and do the dance of death again and again until you make a mistake. They only need you to make one. Damn. He makes a convincing argument. There's no going back to your old life, Layla. I never planned to. But you'd finally be able to work on the Animus project. Our version of it. And with us, you'd always have the freedom to do things your way. Don't say no. Fine. Let's do this. That doesn't mean I'm on your side. Huh. <laughs> Good enough. Alright, well first we gotta finish our Animus. Yep, there we go. Yeah, so that's pretty much it, I guess. Uh, it's very discombobulated. It kind of requires you to know what's going on with other games in the Assassin's Creed franchise. That's the one thing I'm kind of glad. Like, I'm glad they didn't drag on with this, because if you're new to the franchise with this game, then that scene probably confused you with all the characters they mentioned, you know? Uh, like, who's William Miles and who's Sophia Ricken? Uh, that's why, honestly, I don't want to talk about it. Ancient many or may consider... May, okay, wait. Consisted mainly mainly of free men and not galley slaves. Oh, I didn't know that actually. I always thought they were slaves. All right, here we go. The Tyrrhenian Sea. Kind of a that's a fun name. Uh, you know what's coming, don't you? Is that what Foxy does? A gift? No. It's a relic. I don't want to talk about it, Demastis. Isn't that Bayex? Let me have it. I'll give it to Foxy does myself. He loves this. Chill, thing. bro. I'm in no mood for compromise today. Damn. That's my girl. I'll be right back, by the way, guys. I gotta go check out how much ice is in our freezer, apparently, for my parents. Okay, I'm back. And the answer was two. Two bags are in our freezer. In case you wanted to know, Mom. You'll be standing in rooms for them in two days' time. Damn. That's a long trip, though. I can feel no decision is easy. You are a chosen one. And now you are free. <laughs> like me. <laughs> so begins a new day. Damn. It's kind of depressing. But, you know, again, I think she made the right choice. All right, well. Guess she doesn't love you anymore, Bayek. 
Wow. Kind of ironic. Anyway, yeah, so we got a, a long trip ahead of us. And there is going to be quite a few insanely difficult fights ahead of us. So, this is it. And I'm being totally honest. Like, this is really it. If we get past the sailing mission, I am totally confident this game will be beaten. Not this episode, but the next episode. But this is like the last mission that's really staying in our way. As you can see, the level 45 thing we did means absolutely nothing right now. Do you see? Don't drop your guard entirely. We should assume they are expecting us. Why would they be expecting us though? That's what confuses me here. Eager, old man. Eager to be done with this scum. And move on to the next pile of scum. Yeah, you tell him. Infinite scum. Such is the world we live in. I need to get my ram speed back. I like the guy banging the drum there in the middle of us. We're trying, man. Oh, I see some ships coming. We have been spotted. Oh, Lord, have mercy. I'm a soul. Prepare yourselves. Well, that's all right. I'm ready for their navy. Woo -wee. Okay, well, that's a lovely sign. Uh, okay. They're all coming from that direction, at least. Okay, there goes one. Already, that's lovely. Oh, God. Man, I missed all of those. Why do I brace for what? Oh, that. There's some counterfire biatch. How to keep missing? I'm such an ass. Okay, but as long as I reach the checkpoint, that's like the biggest thing. Okay, if I do this, that should be enough. Nice. Okay, there we go. The Roman fleet has been sunk. Uh, there's gonna be a lot more ships than that, though. Don't worry, my boys. Just kidding. That's the whole mission. I wish. How nice would that be if that was all it was? They set fire ships upon us! Gods. Yeah, these things suck. Hope you enjoyed that cutscene. We are overwhelmed! Damn, they are wrecking our ships. We must sink them before they reach us. They'll do us if they strike us. Take them down! I'm scared. The fire ships are pretty easy to kill, though. They're pretty much like one hits. I wonder actually how they aim these things, because they're like coming at me. Like Cleopatra. There we go. More fire ships? Oh, Lord, have mercy. At least I got this. I can already sink this guy right here. Or like miss miserably, that works too. God dang it. Well, I'm just gonna focus on this guy real quick. And at least if I take him down. Yeah. Ugh. You know what? Screw it. We're doing this. We haven't done this in a while. Nice. Okay, and just hit him down low. Hit him where the sun don't shine. Ah, it's so hard to aim when I'm this close to him, though. There we go. Oh, look at these fire ships right next to me. Shit, shit, shit. We gotta get the heck out of here. Yeah, we're going down. We're going down. Damn it. That was terrible. I totally was not even thinking about the fire ships for that last like 10 seconds. God damn it. Told you, this last section's gonna be a bitch. I knew it was. <sighs> That's fine. The only thing that sucks is I'm gonna have to redo that whole section. Our fleet is too tightly formed. They'll hit. Okay, take down a few fire ships. Fire! Okay, there we go. Now we're looking good. Actually, let's just take down all the fire ships first. First, let me get this guy with the catapult. Okay, dead. And just that last one over there. Where is he? 
Am I not reaching from where I am? Okay, I got him. I was like, why can't I reach him from that? Is that all of them? Oh god, that ship's still alive. I didn't know that. I was like, where's the last ship? Oh, he's gonna ram me. Oh lord! Okay, we're safe. Oh, we're not safe. Where? Amen to that. Another fleet there! Lost! Shoves pissing on our heads from the peak of Olympus. Okay, here the the big boys are coming out now. Brutus and Cassius, look! And our cat brought with them. Put it to use! Brace! Alright, here we go. Hey! Don't fear this beast. She's a great and girthy race, but you'll dance around their folks like Zeno's in a fog. Mm, is there another one on the other side of me? Okay, I was like, I was getting fired at from over there, too. God, this is gonna get frustrating. I just gotta really use the cannons. I think the cannons are gonna be like the big saving grace here. God, I'm so nervous! Really want my cannons back. Come on, Brutus! Help me out, my brother! Okay, we're good. Okay. Gotta pull you. And that should be enough to kill him. Yes! We just have the one last ship. As long as we stay away, I think we'll be safe. There we go. Okay, we're destroying all his cannons. Okay, it looks like he's kind of running away too, doesn't it? But that's also good because he's going to be stuck there for a second. See, the catapults do so much damage. That is like our saving grace here. We are looking good right now. I wonder if he's turning himself around because the other cannons. Oh, he's coming right this way, too. Oh, here we go. This should be it right here. Boom! That was good work right there. Nice. Okay, so the Octoremes have been sunk. Our, like, I mean, I guess it wasn't one ship. I guess there was a lot of ships. But we're pretty much the only ship that did anything, to be fair, so. What port are you taking us to? There's a town called Antium I'd like to try. Lots of merchants sail in and out of there. Should be safe for you. From yeah, I hope so. Ride to Rome. Should be is not really a safe answer, I feel like. But that's fine. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Okay, so things are about to get super real here, guys. I hope you're ready for this next mission, because uh, I sure as heck am not. That was a lot of fun, though. We did good on that boat mission. I'm proud of you. Proud of you guys for sticking it out. That was pretty much all we did today, huh? Well, I guess we fought Flavius, too. I guess actually we did a lot. I was going to say, I feel like I should keep the episode going because we only did that boat section, but I might be calling it quits in a second here. Uh, before whatever happens, happens. Oh, I think there's just a cutscene, though. It is only a matter of days before Caesar will officially become a tyrant. There he is. People Look at that guy. You, Caesar. You're a god. The Senate will not bow so easily in a parliament of clucking heads. <laughs> Let me be your wolf. Okay. Whatever you want, man. Go. Do nothing until I get this in Dang. Oh, 
Oh lord, damn, damn, there it is. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. She is such a badass. So I hope you're ready. Septimius and Aya. The fight we've all been waiting for. And unfortunately, you're gonna have to wait a little bit longer. Oh god, because we're not gonna do that until the next episode, ladies and gentlemen. Um, sorry for the cliffhanger, but uh, this is gonna be a part of the finale. I think. I think with the way everything lines up, this is going to work out together real nicely. I hope. So, with that being said, if you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I will see you next time in what will hopefully be the finale of Assassin's Creed Origins. If it's not, though, you'll know. Bye, guys.